Hey guys, you want to style a wig with me? I am going out for dinner with my husband. I'm all ready to go, got my clothes on, and I need to get my wig ready. And I'm going to wear Trend Alert by Gabor in the color SS Cappuccino. I just reviewed it today and I just unboxed it today. I fell in love with this wig. I raved about it and I will be sharing my unboxing with you guys. I was going to put that out first, but maybe I'll just do this first and then I'll share with you my unboxing maybe tomorrow or something because it's fun to see a wig out of the box. And you guys, I want you to know something about unboxings. Uh, when I do unboxings, it is the first time I've seen those wigs. Most of the time, I haven't even looked up to see what kind of wig is coming. I just look at my hair, you guys. It's so bad. It's just yucky. I'm trying to do some content that need I need to have hair for, so I'm growing it out, but man, I miss my buzz head really a lot. Anyway, um, I get these wigs in, and I don't know what, what it is. I don't really pay attention. Um, when name brand wigs asks me if I want to review something, I always say yes, because it's going to help somebody, uh, whether it's for me or not, but um, I forget. And so the first time I'm seeing it in an unboxing with you guys is truly the first time I'm seeing it. So when you see my reaction, if I'm like, oh, like this one, it's, it's like genuine. I'm seeing it for the first time and I'm so excited. So anyway, here is trend alert. <laughs> I love this wig, you guys. Oh my gosh. It is like what I had hoped I could. I've never had a wig quite like this, and I've always wanted hair like this. This seems to be the in hair right now with, um, you know, influencers and people on Instagram where they get their hair cut in a, like a little bit of a layered bob, and then they put in these kind of curls. And I can't figure out how you put curls like this in. I have no idea. I could never uh, duplicate this with a human hair wig. And so now I don't have to because it's this. Now, this looks really cute as it is. We don't have to style this one, but I kind of want to. I want to have a little bit of fun with it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use two products that I've reviewed and I have reviews on YouTube and you can find them. I'm going to use Tressler Wig Wax and Aesthetica Sea Salt Spray. All right. So I'm Three different companies, Gabor, Tressilor, Aesthetica. They're all wonderful and I'm so grateful for all the companies putting great wigs and great products out there for those of us suffering with hair loss or just those of us who maybe aren't losing our hair, but you know what? We don't want to deal with it. We want to throw hair on and go. So I just want to make it clear. And by the way, guys, if you have a little stray fiber that won't cooperate, just pull it out. It's not going to hurt your wig. It's not going to make your wig bald. You could do that a, a hundred times and your wigs will be fine. A thousand times. There's so many fibers in these. Um, but anyway, I just want you to know you don't have to style it, but you can. So I'm going to get a little more lift in the front here with the wig wax. And then I'm going to play up these waves with the sea salt spray. Game? All right, let's do it. So I'm going to just spray the wig wax. And you guys, this right here is kind of my favorite... Uh, styling product right now. What I love about it, I'm going to grab my little fan. So I have this little handheld fan that I got on Amazon for my hot flashes and I love using it to help dry the styling spray fiber on my lip gloss. All right. So what I love about this Tressler wig wax, first of all, it works phenomenally on synthetic wigs and it, you can use it on human hair as well, but it works so well on synthetic wigs. So many styling products don't work great on synthetic wigs. Hairspray and things like that just don't work great. Um, something with the fibers, but this stuff is like gold. Not only, look at that you guys, not only does it work super, super well, it does not gum up your wigs. I can use this over and over and over again on a wig and it's not me. I don't have to wash it any more often. I actually use this spray on my Tressalure Trend wig a lot. Um, I love that wig. I've shared it multiple times here on the channel. I don't know why I closed this. And, um, and I don't feel the need to have to wash it. It, you know, you do have to reuse it. And I think that now it will hold the whole time you have the wig on. 
but when you take the wig off and store it, it seems to sort of fade away a little bit. And so I think that's part of the charm of it. It works and it holds all day, but it doesn't gum up your wigs. Like some styling uh, stuff, sort of like the Aesthetica Sea Salt. It, it does coat the fibers, and I do feel I need to wash my wigs more often with this. But you know what? That's okay too. I think for different applications, the wig wax isn't going to get me more beachy waves, uh, but the sea salt spray will. So you have to ask yourself, and then you just scrunch it in. You have to ask yourself, what's your goal? What are you trying to achieve? If your number one goal is that you don't want to wash your wigs more often, you don't want something uh, to gum up your wigs, you don't want to feel it in your wigs, then maybe you don't use some products that will do that. I think this one won't do that. You can use it as much as you want. But if you're looking to, you know, enhance a style, maybe you want some more beachy waves, then it's a trade-off, right? Everything in life is a trade-off. You just have to figure out what matters to you most. I can't even see what I'm doing, so hopefully this is working. You just have to ask yourself what matters to you most and then act accordingly, right? This mirror is really dirty. I should have washed it. Oh, well. Look at how quick that was, you guys. I need just a little bit more of this weight wax right here to get this to pull back. I don't know why I keep closing this. I'm still using it. And it's kind of a pain to get open sometimes. I do have this fan linked. Actually, I'll have everything linked in my bio to make it easy for you. When I link to Amazon, it is an affiliate link and your purchase doesn't cost you any more money, but it does help me and my, my channel and my ministry because it allows me to do more. It allows me to put more time into this. I'm still working a job outside this stuff. This is not my job. Um, I don't make enough money for this to be my job, but your support is so appreciated. Look at that. Now, you might not want this much volume. You might not want to amp up your style. Okay, I've got a stray again. Goodbye, no problem. But if you do, I've just given you two products. Look at how quickly this worked. They're amazing. And I'm all set for date night. Again, the wig wax, I think anybody should have this if they're ever gonna wanna get lift in the front or style their hair. It won't gum up your wig. You won't have to wash it more often. I use the sea salt spray just a little bit more sparingly, but I didn't put very much in. If I would have put more in, then I would feel it a lot more, but I didn't. So this is gonna be just fine. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Was this helpful? Because I really want to help you guys. This isn't, I'm not trying to put myself out there for any other reason. So let me know if this was helpful. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Thanks for watching. I hope you have a great night.